okay now find the hcf by using prime factorization method okay we are find the hcf by using prime factorization method okay how we are going to do the prime factorization method already i taught you but anyhow the first one i am going to do this a 27 so you have to find the factor of 27 first after that you'll go for 36 okay so 27 this is the prime factorization method so 3 into 9 so these are any two factors of this so 3 into 9 you can get what 27 so again you have to find the factor of what 9 so 3 into 3 you can get it so these are the factors of 27 so factors of 27 is equal to 3 into 3 into 3 so factor of 27 what 3 into 3 into 3 so 3 into 3 what 9 9 into 3 27 next you have to find out 36 so again so 2 and 18 next 2 into 18 you can get 36 so again 18 you will find the factor of 18 so 2 into 9 you will find the factor of what 9 3 into 3 so what are the factors 2 into 2 into 3 into the last you have to take two factors simultaneously so factors of that is 36 you can get what 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into sorry 3 into 3 so 2 into 2 what 4 4 into 3 what 12 12 into 2 36 so 2 into 2 4 4 into 3 12 12 into 3 36 so you have to circle you have to find the common factor so common factor common factors is equal to these two numbers 27 36 is 3 into sorry 3 comma 3 first you write 3 comma 3 because 3 into 3 and 3 into 3 so for these two three you have to write only one time for these two uh, the three you have to write only one time so for these two you have to write three for these two you have to write only one time three so these are the common factor after this multiplying the common factors multiplying the common factors multiplying the common factors multiplying the common factors that is 3 into 3 you can get 9 so this is the what hcf by using prime factorization so hcf of 27 and 36 is what 9 this is the answer so this is the answer for this question so we are using prime factorization method but we, are, we are, will find only hcf we will find hcf by using prime factorization method for these two numbers given in the question so 27 and 36 you are going to find out the prime factorization method for 27 and 36 first you have to find for 27 then you can go to 36 so 27 3 into 7 you can get 37 these are the two factors any two factors so again you have to find the factor of 9 that is 3 into 3 so what are these factors for 27 3 into 3 into 3 so 3 into 3 into 3 that is what i have written so 3 into 3 into 3 what is this? 3 into 3 9 and 9 into 3 27 so next is uh, 36 so you have to find the factor of what 36 so 2 into 18 that is 36 so you have to find the factor of 18 so 2 into 9 then you have to find the factor of 9 that is 3 into 3 that is so write all the factors 2 into 2 into 3 into 3 so factors of 36 equal to 2 into 2 into 3 into 3 2 into 2 2 into 2 3 into 3 so I'll repeat again for 36 you have to find the factor so 2 into 18 you can get 36 then 18 you have to for 18 you have to find the factor of uh, factor so 2 into 9 you can get 18 then you will find the factor of 9 that is 3 into 3 so 2 into 2 into 3 into 3 so how many 2's there are 2 2's and uh, 2 3's 
so these are factors so 2 into 2 4 4 into 3 12 12 into 3 36 you can get the factor of 36 factors of 27 3 into 3 into 3 so 3 into 3 9 9 into 3 you can get 27 after that you will find the common factor so common factor means in this uh, i've told you already common factor mean, that means the factor is present in both numbers so 3 in 3 both 3s are present in the both numbers again 3 into 3 so 3 and 3 you have to write you have to write only one time so for these two three you have to write only one time so common factor is 3 comma 3 then after that step is multiplying the common factors that is 3 into 3 you can get 9 so HCF for 27 and 36 this is highest to common factor is 9 this is the method we are find the HCF by using the prime factor session this is the first time we have done it